We learn new details today about the allegations being leveled against suspended Senator Patrick Brazo. He's accused of assault and sexual assault, and documents released in court today outline his accuser's version of events. The woman alleges she was choked, groped, and thrown down a flight of stairs. Global National Shirley Engel has been following the story for us. Shirley. Donna, the disturbing allegations are detailed in these court documents obtained by Global News. The alleged victim is protected under a publication ban. Now, in her version of events that fateful morning, she called 911 crying, saying she had marks on her body after an altercation with Patrick Brazo. That led to the charges of assault and sexual assault against the former Tory senator. <laughs> According to the documents used to get a search warrant, it was a two-day dispute over Aboriginal issues that set Brazo off on the morning of February 7th. The woman told police the senator ordered her to leave this home in Gatineau, Quebec, after she told him she didn't support him on the matter. When she went to collect her things, she alleges he followed her and turned violent, pushing her, hitting her arm, and tearing a yellow and black bra and mauve sweater she was holding. She alleges he grabbed her breast aggressively and pulled down her pants, breaking the button and zipper, used vulgar words in English and French and spat in her face, putting his hand around her throat to strangle her. The woman alleges he pushed her down the stairs so hard that the railing she was holding onto broke. By the time she called 911, Brazo had locked himself in the bedroom upstairs, she says. Brazo's version of events has not yet been made public. Calls to his lawyer were not returned today. He has entered a plea of not guilty, writing on Twitter after his release on bail, I'm wounded not, but I'm not slain. I'm bruised and faint. They say just let me lie and bleed a while. I'll not be long this way. Though none of the allegations in the documents have been proven in court, the Senate has officially suspended Brazo while his case makes its way through the courts. His next appearance is scheduled for March 22nd. Donna? All right, Shirley Engel in Ottawa, thanks.